For the first time in nearly nine months, the Mercier's men's and women's hockey programs are gearing up for games this weekend. Starting with Rick Gawkins' Lakers, their last game of the 2019-2020 season was on March 7th when they were swept by Air Force in the first round of the Atlantic Hockey Playoffs. Like many programs across the nation, the offseason for the Lakers was not normal. Anticipating a return to play, the Lakers were back on campus in August only to have the start of their regular season be pushed back to two months. Yeah, it's very exciting. Uh, it was very questionable if we were even going to get some games in. It was back and forth, so, you know, we just kept our heads on straight, buried our heads, just kept working, and all the guys were ready to go. I think the energy the last few days has been really good. Um, I think it's been the best it has been all year. Um, we had a little mishap with having to go into quarantine and everything, but since guys have done that, they feel that we're ready to go for games this weekend. We need to live every day like it's our last. You never know. Even if there wasn't a pandemic, you never know what, when we're going to be playing, like what could happen uh, You know, in this world. Crazy times right now, unprecedented times. So, yeah, like again, we're just excited to be playing here. The home and home series between Mercyhurst and Bowling Green takes place this Saturday and Sunday with no fans in attendance. Saturday's game at Bowling Green begins at 1.30 and then Sunday afternoon the contest will start at 3 p.m. from the Mercyhurst Ice Center. The last time head coach Mike Sisti and the Lady Lakers were on the ice competitively was March 7th when they won the CHA championship for the 13th time in program history by knocking off Robert Morris in overtime 2-1 in Buffalo. Ranked in the top 10 in this year's preseason poll, the Lady Lakers have found being at the rink a sanctuary in blocking out reality for a few hours. All of us are going through something different during this pandemic, and I think each of us bring something for another person on our team, so I think that's been beneficial. Like if someone's having a hard day, then someone who's having a better day can bring them up, so I think that's been helpful. I mean, this is our family away from family. Uh, this is home, the rink's home, Mercier's is home, and being here together means that we're gonna get through it together no matter what. It has been a long journey, but overall I've been super excited, and we're, uh, we've been preparing for a long time to get back on the ice, and I think we're ready to go. It's amazing to just get away from reality and just focus on hockey because like obviously our program has been pretty successful so it's just good to get on the ice and focus on those parts of the game and just winning well once the season comes back but obviously that's what we're focusing on. And the Lady Lakers will battle CHA foe RIT four times in the month of December. The first set of home and home games occurs this weekend with the Lady Lakers hosting the Tigers at the Mercyhurst Ice Center beginning at 3 p.m. Again, no fans in attendance. Then on Sunday, the same two teams will compete in Rochester starting at 3 p.m.